What's going on y'all, DMJ.bt here. So today I'm gonna to be talking about my 2020 to 2021 gaming PC and PC setup. So this PC setup was kind of like built for like where I'm at at home right now. Um, I'm planning to have like a better setup as the years progress, but we're gonna be talking about the CPUs I have. I have the AMD, um, AMD Ryzen 5 processor, and I have the GPU. Um, RTX 580 plus this is the AMD Radeon and then I also have the two two terabyte um, HDD and then I have a 500 gigabyte SSD with 32 gigabytes of RAM and this is DDR4 um, it's pretty good pretty good um, I wouldn't ask for anything less this computer runs as fast as it can be but I also have little problems with like just certain applications that's like crashing um, especially if you have uh, Microsoft applications, they have been crashing recently. I don't know, but we're gonna see about if they give us more updates to fix certain things. But let's get into it. All right, so right here, Ryzen 5, uh, six core, uh, 12 thread processor, runs pretty well, runs pretty efficiently. This is the um, 3700X model, um, which is not too far off date. Uh, we have the Pulse Radeon RTX, as I said, 580. Then I have a 600 watt. Um, game max um, power brick so this is like what's running my whole computer as itself it's a power supply and then I also have the prime x 570p motherboard um, I don't I've been using this for my CPU but I haven't been using this cooler that they gave me for the right um, Ryzen because uh, I don't know I just felt like this one would pack more of a punch it has has keep my CPU warm so and I've also been seeing reviews um, you can still use this you know there's nothing really wrong with it but I just professionally want my CPU to run super quick super fast um, so yeah and then I have the Skeptry um, display and but I know what you guys want to see you guys want to see how the PC looks so let's get all right so this is the PC right here I have to do some little bit more cable management but um yeah so i want to show you guys what it looks like and how things are running so let's take off this glass screen case and let's get all right so as you guys can see here this is the mid tower um this is a mid tower casing but i'm also going to be leaving a description about where i got it from and stuff of that nature so um right here i have some little bit of cable management i'm trying to get better at that but um this PC runs really well. I really wouldn't ask for anything else. Um, as you can see here, it's nice. It doesn't have RGB GPU, so, but it gets the job done. Also, you have the required, as I showed before, the CPU um, fan, pretty good. Everything runs well. And this mid tower only comes with um, three fans. So um, if you want to get extra fans, I personally would suggest going to Micro Center, they have deals. Um, so I have three um, header fans here, and then I have one for the back fan. One back fan here, two um, fans up here to take out the, um, you know, more of the heat flow and push it out. Yeah, so that's what I did here. And what else would I say? Um, if you're doing anything of music production wise or video editing, or even streaming as a gamer, this PC would be the right thing for you. It's, you know, um, performances, so I'm gonna show you that now. All right, so some of the key points I wanna take away is um, processing speed. So I'm gonna open up a few little things. Let me open up my music collection app, this. Um, open up Doom as well. Now, given that this is, has 32 gigabytes of RAM, you're, Applications would load really quickly, um, especially if you're somebody that wants to get things done. Things like this would um, happen for you. Um, I'll also be showing like a screen overlay of like me playing the game as well, so you guys can see how you know everything works and the frames per second and stuff of that nature. So you're going to be seeing that here in a bit. But what I want to get to is 4K. So since this is a 4K monitor, this monitor would you know produce 4k but sometimes with different manufacturers such as myself that i just purchased this doesn't come in hdr so the problems with that is i can't get a real high definition resolution with a 4k display and 
as you would tell, that kind of sucks if you want to see certain things. But I mean, it gets the job done. Um, this PC literally just does everything I want it to. So um, we're gonna get into some little gameplay, and I'm gonna be showing you guys some things you could do. And let's get into it. So there it is. Um, yeah, this overall this cost me one thousand two hundred seventy five dollars. Uh, I did this whole of twenty twenty of last year. The price is gonna fluctuate as I'm gonna show you here on um the links verified in my description. It'll show you like how the prices have been flipped from them and stuff like that. So it's a DMJ beats here. Thank you for tuning in. Appreciate all the people who subscribed and everything of that nature, so, peace.